Hey guys, Dr. Linda Kramer. Okay, today I've just finished about an hour ago. Um, I was doing a video on how bad people can teach us life lessons. During that video, my front door opened and then slammed quite violently. So I want to let you know, guys, whenever I do my videos for YouTube, I always ensure that the house is secure before I video and I never have the front door open because I'm usually here alone when I do my videos and you know you don't want just someone coming to your front door and just yelling through the screen door right so I always make sure the front door is locked but during that video it is very apparent because of this, the loudness of the bang that you can hear my front door open and then slam so why do ghosts do this sort of stuff okay this is a topic that a lot of people have asked me over the years why do they do this random stuff for okay so I want to let you all know I'm I had a book that was available on my website it's called ghosts exposed and <laughs> I'm actually rewriting it right now as I speak. Well, not right now, but, you know, this coming week, I will be trying to get it finished. Um, and it's going to be called Ghosts, A Conscious Distortion. Because what I'm going to do in this video, in this book, is try and debunk the scientific reasons as well as the psychological reasons why ghosts stay on Earth. And on top of all these theories, I'm going to put in some real ghost stories about what has happened to me in my past. So then you know what I do as a psychic medium, a ghost investigator, um, as well as an NDE who's had a near-death experience who died in 2001. So this book is going to be like an educational book where not only do you understand why and how they come through, but the why and how they stay here, okay? So this little video, I'm going to just upload it. If you think this is a good idea of the avenue, you know, because, hello, let's just go there. Out there right now, there are countless, and I'll just say countless books on ghost stories. Not too many people actually debunk it and try and prove how they stay here and why they stay here. So if you think that this is a good idea for me to bring out this book, can you please press the like button on this video? If you don't like it, please do not press the dislike button, okay? Please don't do that, okay? So then at least then, you know, if I get, say, 100 views on this video and there's 20 likes, then I know then that there's, pardon me, about 20% of people who think that this is a good idea, okay? <laughs> Pardon me. So, you know, how much activity happens in my house? I do say every day something moves or there's a noise bang or something else happens. Um, but today it happened right in the middle of when I was doing that live video. So it's called How Bad People Teach Us Life Lessons. If you want to go and watch it, I'll give you a hint. It's in there. Okay. <laughs> You'll hear it because I know I heard it and it's through my microphone. Um, yeah, so let me know what you think of it. And, you know, listen to what I was talking about when I said that because I was talking about healing. Okay. And that's one thing that ghosts do have to go through is that healing of why they're staying here. So I'm going to start incorporating more ghost stories and more theories as to why they stay around and what the why they do things, okay, to try and debunk this. Because not only do I want to be a sharer of paranormal stories, and I certainly don't just want to be another ghost investigator, oh, here's another EVP, because there's a lot of people out there now doing that, okay. And I really do appreciate the work that they do, because it's opening the eyes of the paranormal, exactly. And, you know, it um, unless we get that proof out there, then it'll never be a definitive um, consciousness that they recognize. So, of course, I love these ghost hunters who go out on their Friday night 
filming and trying to get bangs in the night. You know, I've done that many, many times over the years as well, and I love doing it. Um, you know, and I love, love, love educating people. So I'm going to start doing some educational pieces that will be um, going into my book. My book right now, Ghost Exposed, it was about 109 pages. So I've taken out probably 40 pages and I'm going to add in more ghost stories, more theories on, you know, like psychological as well as scientific theories as to why they hang around and what they go through, you know. Um, and I've also added now a question and answer. Yay! So there's going to be a question and answer thing at the back. Questions that we can ask a ghost questions that we never want to ask a ghost and questions ghosts ask us. So it's going to be a very interesting book. I'm quite excited for it. Um, obviously my daughter's been home at this point over school holidays and then it was extended by two weeks where she was supposed to go back two weeks ago but now she's going back on Monday um, which is the 7th of February 2022. So once she starts school, I'm going to be home a lot through the day by myself again. So I will be concentrating on this book. I've given myself two weeks to get it done. So then I can um, stick it to a professional pub, um, editor so that he can edit it, etc. And I can then get it on Lulu with my other book. OK, so there you go, guys. Please press the like button if you think that this is a good idea about doing videos where I start talking about ghosts as well. Okay. And we all have this interest in it, you know, um, in a nutshell, spirits go to heaven. Ghosts are the ones who stay earthbound. Okay. So I already explained all this in this book that I'm going to be bringing out and it will be called ghosts, a conscious distortion. There you go. So I hope that you enjoy today's videos. I loved it how my door slammed in my last video, which is presently uploading onto YouTube. So, um, yeah, go and have a listen to that and um, tell me why you think they did that. You've got to listen to what I was saying at that point. So then we can ascertain what were they trying to let us know about. OK. All right. So that's the end of today's. I just wanted to touch base. Please press the like button if you think this is a good idea. I'll talk to you all again soon. Bye. To learn more about your Solistic Alignment, please press the like button and click subscribe. To purchase any of Dr. Linda Kramer's books or services, please visit www.lindaray.info.